Hey guys, so today I just wanted to give you a quick review of this wig. I get so many questions on this wig and whenever I post a picture on Instagram wearing this wig, I always get so many questions from you guys. Now this wig is a wig I bought from a company called RPG Show Hair. It's an online company and uh, at that time it had so much hype. I bought this hair in 2016 July. So yes, I've had this hair for three good years. Yes, it holds up well, but before I go to that, let's just go to the receipt. Let me put the receipt up there on the screen so you can get to see the whole details of the wig. So as you can see, this wig uh, is called the Anthony Katz 020. It was a collab between Anthony Katz. Anthony Katz is a very well-known hairstylist on uh, Instagram. You should definitely check him out. I will leave his Instagram link down below so you can go and check, them, check it out. So as you can see, the hair color is like the picture, but that is <laughs> that is a lie. Actually, the hair color that I got in th this wig in was very different from what is in the picture in the website. I'll put a link uh, that links you directly to the website so you can see what I'm saying. It came in an ashy blonde kind of uh, shade and for me ashy blonde honestly looks terrible on me so actually i don't even have a picture of how the wig was looking like as soon as i got it because i think i went instantly into toning it now i did go to amazon and i bought these toners this is the wella this is the, the wella toners i think they are about I don't know how many dollars they are on, uh, but check them out on, on uh, Amazon. So I use these toners. The one I use was T27, if I'm not wrong. And uh, I used it to tone down the hair. That's the first thing that I did. So if you have any blonde wig or any wig that looks a bit orange and uh, you want to change the tone, so the Wella toners do that very, very well. And the point is I had to tone this hair to get the shade I wanted. So once I toned it, it became like a beige, beige uh, kind of a shade, and that was a bit more better for my skin tone. So one of the things that people complain most about RPD show here is that they that they're not true to color. You buy a wig like and how it looks like on the website and how it looks like when you receive it are completely totally different things. Poor job. Literally, I guess, I don't know if it's the blonde they don't know how to do or what, but literally, you guys, like, this, and I want I want to get, like, close for you guys. Yo, that is not good blending. I mean, I did expect it to be a little bit blonde, not, like, really, like, to me, this looks gray. That was how it was in the past, and that's what I, I saw in most reviews. I don't know if they've changed, I hope they have, but that is the thing with RPG show here. So because of that, I became very worried about buying any hair that they have that is dyed so if i'm gonna buy from rpg show i buy number one b so anyway going on with the details in of the wig you can see that the texture is silky it's not nanyaki it's nanyaki so and then the density is 200 yes that is true it has quite quite some density to it it has out of density it's good density and it curls very well as well and the lace color is a light brown and then the cap construction is a cap B, wig cap, wig cap color is brown, uh, and so on and so on. So as you can see by the receipt that I put there, the cost of the wig came to 45k, 45 to 71.80 Kenya shillings. And then another thing to note when you're buying hair from RPG Show Hair, in case you plan to buy their hair, is that they charge a $30 fee, $30 to ship any order to Kenya. So if you have a wig that you want to buy, you have to pay an extra $30. And that happened two times when I ordered from them. So keep that in mind when you want to order from them. Otherwise, the wig is good, guys. I love the wig. I have done so many things to this wig. I have dyed it. I have bleached it. <laughs> What have I not done? I, I, I bleached the knots as well on the on the lace itself, so to make it a bit more natural to have a, this natural pattern. And also, their wigs have a very very wide parting space, like from from here until until here. This is where the tracks begin. The tracks begin here, so you have a parting space all the way from here all the way to the back. 
uh, now because of this is a blonde wig it also gets so much attention so if you're not ready for the attention I'm just telling you in advance like anytime I'm wearing this wig around town I always get so so much attention people calling me mzungu you have no idea how many times I have been called mzungu because of this wig so I do do love this wig so much it's a nice unique wig so like I said I, I did have to uh, bleach it and dye it I used some box dyes from um, I can't honestly remember I can't remember exactly which dyes I used but in case I do I will make sure I link them down below so but it was just some blonde dyes some beige blonde dyes from wrong so that's it to this week it takes and because of a uh, constant uh, flat ironing and constant usage and for three years dying uh, flat ironing and uh, washing and all that because of all that it's started to not right now it's kind of like breaking up a bit when i comb it i feel like let me try to comb it and get my comb like when i try to comb it i feel like it kind of like breaks more nowadays than it used to but that is normal it's expected with with the hair over time the hair of course will lose its uh, density its uh, texture things will change it even if you're with the normal hair it also happens i do love the hair it's a it's good hair it has it's a, it has taken a lot for those three years because i the settlements use it consistently constantly so it's a good wig and i definitely recommend that you check them out also they always have discounts from time to time like right now i log into my account i have an 80 dollar discount like an 80 dollar of any wig i buy i can get 80 dollars deducted from that amount so they always have good offers from time to time so you should definitely check them out that's it uh guys that is the review on this week love it if you want to buy it i'll put the link down below and you check it out and until next time guys see ya